Hi everyone. In this video, I will teach you how to create a modern travel poster design in Adobe Photoshop. The document size is 1080 by 1350. Go to the rectangle tool and draw a square in the bottom right corner. Go to the Direct Selection tool, select the bottom point, and drag it up. Select the Pen tool, and click on this point to minus. Then add a point to the top and left side. Go back to the Direct Selection tool, and follow me here to make a curve like this. Go to the File menu, Place Embedded, select the image, and click on Place. Adjust its size and position. Drag it to the layer down. Go to the Polygonal Lasso tool, and make a selection. and add a layer mask to it. Select the shape layer, right click on it to open the blending options. Apply the gradient to it. Follow my gradient settings. Then I have this airplane PNG, link to these assets available in the description of the video. Drag it to the main design. Then select the airplane and shape layer, press Ctrl plus J for layer via copy. Right click on them and choose, merge layers. Set the gray foreground color and press Alt plus Shift plus Backspace to apply the foreground color to it. Drag it down in the layers. Press Ctrl plus T, hold the Ctrl button and drag it down. And apply the Gaussian blur to it. Select the background layer, and add a blank layer. Right click on it for clipping mask. Select the darker blue shade of the foreground color. Select the brush tool with these settings. Set the flow and apply. Change the blend mode to multiply. Now it's time to add text here. Follow my text settings.
Go to the Polygon tool, set side to 6 and roundness to 10. And draw it. Press Ctrl plus J for copy of it. Decrease its size. And change fill to outline. And then dotted outline. Add text to it. Follow my text settings. Then I have this dotted global map, linked to these assets in the description of the video. Drag it down in the layer panel. And decrease its opacity. Then drag the arrows, and place them here. Make a copy of this hexagonal shape. Apply the gray color to it. And adjust it like this. Then add Gaussian blur to it. Drag and place the icons. And that's it. Share your thoughts on this. If there is any question, you can ask in the comment section. Make sure you head over to my YouTube channel. Where I upload graphic related tutorials. Thank you for watching.